what's up everybody this is take a step away from tumblr here bring you guys a discussion and today we're going to be talking about the possibility of ash's mom and serena's mom meeting each other for the first time ever and to that with me to discuss this topic is hey guys you just like here hello everybody my name is alpha Hebe. and let's get started so one of the questions that we're gonna ask each other is do you think they'll ever meet would it ever happen so before I give my answer, what are your guys' thoughts on this, DJ? Uh, yeah, I think it's very possible that they're going to meet sometime in the future. Like, maybe they'll meet up at uh, uh, Ash's College League performance, like Grace comes to watch, and obviously Deedley's going to be watching, maybe she'll show up in person. And also, uh, it might be interesting because for all we know, maybe they've never met before, so this could be our first time, it could be like a reuniting thing. I think there's a lot of potential there, and if it happened, I think it'd be really cool to see. Yeah, I can agree with DJ. I mean, you know, Ash and Serena, they both met during her childhood days, and they were both at the cancer region at the same time. So I think, you know, at some point, either um, Delia and Grace knew each other at the time, or maybe they didn't, who knows? But if they were to ever meet up within the X and Y series, like DJ said, I one of the few factors that it could happen is that they could meet up maybe during Ash's uh, Pokemon League matches, or uh, sometime after that, you know, it makes someone like someone of a mini arc around two or three episodes revolving around, um, you know, Ash's Serena's past. I think that's a good way to have um, those two be in the episode. So yeah, I think uh, I think it could it could happen. You know, seeing the resemblance between the two. You know, she needs to have a purpose to be there. So, yeah, the Kalos League would be a great place for both of them to meet. But the, why would Grace be there, you know? Maybe she's there to... She was just out of there. Okay, hold on. Why would she be there, guys? Well, I don't know. You, you do bring in a good point. I mean, Grace isn't really all that into, um, you know, Pokemon battles. You know, you know, she's always there to, to support Serena. So she's only known to see the giant Pokemon performances. So... Yeah, unless uh, Serena encourages her mom to watch the Pokemon League for added super support for Ash. So that could be a possibility there. Or maybe like the master class is going on right before the League and her mom comes to watch. And so since she's already in town, she go she watches the College League anyway. Yeah. yeah. And maybe she'd be interested in Ash's um, goal of becoming the Pokemon yeah, it's, Master. It's his, big, it's his big competition too, so she wants to support some of his friends. Yeah, yeah I, I think the only way if it's ever going to happen is that, like, say is the the, the Masterclass uh, trial Pokemon performance happens before the Pokemon League. Obviously, Grace would have to, you know, be there in person. So I think that after the Master Trap Pokemon, uh, she'll uh, eventually be aware of, uh, you know, Ash's uh, plan to uh, participate in the Pokemon League. So I think that's a good way for Grace to uh, attend the Pokemon League. And who knows if... Uh, Delia will also be there as well. So I think that's a good way, or rather a good plan for both mothers to, you know, interact with each other once they're at the Pokemon League. Yeah, I mean, I think about it as well. I mean, maybe Delia also attends Serena's tri Pokemon. She's there a few days early to support Ash at the Kalos League. And maybe she wants to know what Serena does. And same goes for Grace. She wants to know what this boy that she probably knows already that Serena likes Ash, so she probably wants to know a little bit more about Ash and what he does. Guys, so it's a more shipping whoa, channel, so of calm, course I'm gonna down. say that. Calm what? Down there. No, 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 no. See, see, no, 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 no. All right, but um, yeah, maybe she just wants to see what all the hype up is all about, you know, battling and all that. So it'd be great to see Grace supporting Ash. You know, both moms. I I don't think that um. We ever had both moms be at the same event, you know, Don's mom and Delia <laughs> at the same time, or has that happened before? Well, the only, the only, the only, the most recent time I remember from uh, Delia interacted with the mother of um, Ash's female companion was at yeah, like you said back in Diamond and Pearl, but they only communicated through the um, uh, uh, the telephone. Yeah, through the telephone. I would say a telephone, but you could say like the Pokemon version of Skype. Yeah, Skype face face cam. <laughs> yeah. All right. Yeah. So, so, yeah. That that's that's all I know. Like the last time um, Delia has ever interacted with uh, the mother of the female companion. Yeah. So basically, them getting to know their friends better. Okay. Yeah. So next question: Do you think they really know each other? So the possibility of yeah, them this one because while we do know already that Ash and Serena have met each other. 
Um, we're not entirely too sure. Fifty um, fifty on this one. Your yeah, thoughts, kind of DJ? the same with me. Yeah, kind of the same with me. Just uh, it could go either way. Um, yeah, obviously, uh, even though Ash and Serena met, maybe they never actually interacted with each other at the summer camp, or maybe maybe uh, Grayson was never like in uh, Kanto at all, and she just sent Serena there for the one summer. Or maybe she was there, and maybe the moms talked to each other. There's a lot of possibilities there, and it can go any possible way. Yeah, yeah because uh, because as far as I know, like, and, and going back to real life, you know, camps they usually know to at least have some parent supervision. So I think that maybe Delia and Grace could be at summer camp at the time. Uh, who knows if they uh, met each other, got to know each other, or maybe they see each other as strangers. I don't know. But it's like I said, I'm I'm fifty fifty with this one. Yeah, they could have um, known each other as strangers for all we know. And a uh, question that that I don't really want to go in depth to, but like, why would Grace actually be there at the summer camp? You know what I mean? Like, if Serena went there, why would you know they live in Kalos now? So why would Grace send Serena to the Kanto region to attend the summer camp? I mean, they probably used to live at the Kanto region. So maybe Delilah and Grace were probably neighbors or friends, and then you know Delilah really never talked about Grace, and they finally meet each other at the Kalos League if they ever meet. So they could be like, "Hey, you were at the, uh, you were my neighbor or hello, old friend, you know, something like that." So you know, it'd be great to see that happen, if anything. Yeah, I I gotta agree with you, uh, Jess, that. You know, why would Serena travel from Carlos to Kansas just for that specific summer camp? Like, the yeah, the reason that you've explained earlier, like, um, Serena has probably got to live in the Kansas region before, maybe around uh, near Palatine, if anything, if that were to ever happen. So, I don't know, like, thinking of other reasons or factors, I can't really think of one. So, if anything, maybe Serena has probably lived in uh, Kansas before. Yeah, and that brings up our next question, which is, do you think they're going to bring up the summer camp arc? So, if they did meet each other back at the summer camp arc as parents, and, you know, they sent their kids out to the summer Girl camp. that used to play with my son or daughter, so, that'd be great to hear. Your thoughts, guys? Mm, well, it could be that uh, uh, either one of the mothers could recognize um, Ash or Serena as a child. I think that uh, they'll bring up the summer camp arc because if you guys recall, Serena had Ash's handkerchief and she eventually returned it back on episode 7 of the X and Y series. I think that, you know, Delia must have wondered where that handkerchief has gone and I think that by the time Ash um, communicates with his mom, you know, he's gonna bring up the handkerchief and, uh, you know, Delia will probably remember from there, like, oh, I remember that handkerchief, like, I haven't seen it since this, since uh, your, la your summer camp back, like, years ago. So I think, if anything, the handkerchief will be a good signal for them to um, bring back the, uh, what happened at the summer camp. Yeah, they basically pulled on easy coin. What about you, DJ? What do you think? I think one thing that's important to remember is that uh, Grace and Ash have met before. Like uh, in episode 53 where she was at the Rhyhorn training camp and everything. So Grace and Ash have already interacted in person. Uh, we're, I guess we're not completely sure as to whether she knows him as just Ash, the kid who's traveling with Serena, or if she knows that he went to camp with her. So I think we need some more clarification on that. I mean, yeah. for oh, all we God. know, like, like for all we know, she probably just doesn't remember because, you know, Serena being the one who has a crush on Ash, she would remember, like, you know, Ash's features. Like, why would Grace pay attention to Ash's features more? So she probably doesn't recognize him until if she meets the Deli um, Delia again, she'll be like, wait, so I knew you look familiar, but she never mentioned it, you know, she probably just kept it to herself. That's and a possibility. Also, and it'd also be interesting to know if, like, Serena's ever mentioned anything about having a crush on Ash to her, like, whether it be when she was younger and she just met him, or, like, now that she's traveling with him. Because, like, they, I feel like if Serena had mentioned it, she would take more of an interest in it. But that's just me. Maybe, maybe not. Maybe she said something. Maybe she hasn't. Maybe Grace is just letting Serena take care of this on her own. We don't know. Yeah. And then, like, maybe she'll mention, like, you know, 
Um, raising Serena, she was never really interested in other boys. She always avoid not avoided them, but like she always turned them down if she was like that kind of girl to, you know, bring the guys in. But you know, she always turned them down or just ignored them. And she noticed that, and she wondered why. And now she knows why, because she had her heart set up for Ash. So, you know, that'd probably be the case. I don't know. I just want to hear that question or that comment from her. Yeah, that's a good point there. All right. So, last question will be: Will they try to get Ash and Serena together? Wow. <laughs> All right. So, you know how moms are. They're always trying to get their sons or daughters together. You know, they find it cute and all that. But before I give my full answer, your guys' um, answers on this? I'm not 100% sure on whether both moms will try to get Ash and Serena together. I think that the only thing that they ever can on in regards to romance will be uh, Serena's feelings. Because, you know, we, we, as the, all, all of the audience, especially uh, some of the girls such as Miyant and Shauna and even Bonnie, they uh, caught on to Serena's feelings because of her, you know, uh, recognizable blushes here and there. So yeah, it's I think so that, out there. It's so obvious. Yeah. Yeah. So you know, like you said, since it's so obvious, I think that um, uh, Grace and Daly will probably ca catch on to Serena's feelings, and I think that they'll probably help Serena. Um, I think it probably helps Serena uh, exp express her feelings to Ash bit by bit. But I, what I do hope from Delia is that she'll get Ash to. She'll get Ash to, um, well, not get, but introduce Ash into romance or getting to understand the feelings of girls. So, yeah. uh, I think that could happen. Yeah, like my previous comment, maybe just like Grace, Del um, Delia will say, My Ash hasn't really interacted with girls, he's never found them interesting. He was always into Pokemon and all that. So, maybe she'll make a comment like that. Yeah, and, and then another thing too, what you said, like they don't need to, um, you know, catch the hints. They're gonna assume as mothers and just, you know, try to get them together, cause that's what mothers do basically. Like they see a beautiful, cute girl, and they're like, okay, that's, um, I'll try to get my son to get with that girl. You know, that's kind of what moms do. But your your answer, DJ? Yeah, I'm like, if all this stuff were to uh, take place, uh, I'm. I think that both of them would kind of catch on to how Serena feels. That is, if Grace hasn't done it already. But I don't think they're going to... I don't see them actively trying to get them together. I think they may, like, tease that a little bit. Maybe Delia would say something like, Hey, have you noticed anything different about Serena? About how she treats you or something like that? But I don't think there's going to be, like, any real push to get those two together. I don't think they would be the ones to meddle in that kind of thing. And I don't think Pokemon is the kind of show that would go that far with it. Yeah, I think if anything, they'll just uh, tease Ash and Serena or play around with them saying that, like, oh, I, oh, Ash, I actually didn't knew that you've had such a beautiful girlfriend with you this whole time. Yeah, Something that's, like that. Yeah, that's true. But, you, um, like, if you get, if, um, we could go back to the second tri Pokemon that Serena participated in, the constant teases that Mieti was making. If we got um, that amount of teases of you know her teasing about Ash and all that, what's stopping um, Delia and Grace to doing that as well? But you, like you guys said, that's just in a personal opinion. So we don't know what's gonna happen. We're just gonna have to wait if that episode ever does occur, which probably will. I mean, there's no reason for both moms not to meet each other. It'd be a great episode to watch, both of them interacting with one another. And even if it doesn't have to do with a more shipping, maybe Grace will teach um, Dahlia to ride a Rhyhorn, or Dahlia, um I don't know, since Dahlia's uh, such a nice mother, maybe teach Grace some manners, since she's, you know, that kind of mom to be a tomboy mom. I don't know, that's just me. Yeah, just like, more... Just any interactions would be good between those two, I think. It could be Yeah, yeah basically. Yeah. yeah. Professor Oak meeting um, Grace. Professor well. Oak, sh Professor Oak showing up in X Y for once. Yeah, <laughs> no more end title cards, please. Put them in the anime. But we're not here to talk. I about mean, that. he's not even in the end title cards anymore. They got the new thing. <laughs> All right, guys. Well, hopefully you enjoyed th this discussion. Um, at the end of the day, this is a theory, so we don't know if this will happen or not. But if it does happen, maybe one of our theories is right. So, like this Lolo's. video. Yeah, use this for future reference when that episode does happen. So, you know, leave a like, leave a comment. What did you guys think? 
are there any questions that you guys are thinking like maybe uh that we didn't ask ourselves in this discussion um but yeah that's pretty much it any final thoughts on this theory guys uh no x y and z make it stuff happen all right guys well hopefully you enjoyed this discussion this has been take a step away from tumblr here and see that helping me out with this discussion is i've been dj sock puppet and i'll see you all some other time all right thank you guys so much for watching my name is alpha heavy i'll see you guys in whatever video i make next see ya but what if